I am Paula Jean Swearingen. I don't know if you know me or not. Um, I'm a native West Virginian. I'm a coal miner's daughter and granddaughter of my family. Um, I think at least this, six generations back, um, my family is from coal mining. And I have a lot of veterans in my family. Uh, specifically one, my dad passed away at 52 years old. He went to Vietnam and he came home after everything that my family had sacrificed for the Industrial Revolution and the military. And my dad was exposed to Agent Orange and he suffocated to death at 52 years old. In this country, we don't have a budgeting problem. We have a moral problem. Not only will we kill people overseas, but we, when we ask for, not, for our government not to have an inflated military budget, and we want basic human rights, like back home, we don't have even adequate sewage systems. We don't have clean water. We don't have clean air. Not only are they blowing up other countries and they're not worried about children dying in Yemen, but they're blowing up our mountains back home. But one thing that we're at a pivotal time, y'all, when I go to my neighbor, my neighbor's homes, if one of us are hungry, we feed each other. We help each other. If I ask my neighbor for a wrench, he doesn't ask me if I'm a Democrat or a Republican. He comes over and helps me. I run for Congress. I know how corrupt it is. And we have to get dark money out of politics, but we have to quit being divided. One thing that we have been placated to is propaganda. and They spend a lot of money to divide us because if they can divide us, they can conquer us. We need to stand up now and not only fight for now, but fight for future generations. Fight for our children and grandchildren. They are allowed to kill our children in the streets in America. They're allowed to poison their children. I worry every day, not only now, that I used to worry if my children would get cancer, now I have to worry about my grandson getting cancer because of his zip code. When we talk about our veterans, they don't have any place to come home to. In poor communities across the country, they bring the military in to recruit our children in our schools. We have a saying back home, if you don't go into the coal mines, you go into the military or have to sell drugs. That's the only opportunities we, that we have. I left the Democratic Party because of the corruption. We, I joined the People's Party because we have to hold these people accountable. We have to get dark money out of politics. We have to fire the biggest war muggles that they work in that capital. We have to, they're the biggest drug dealers work in that capital. They are funding the war machine. They are killing our children. They are killing us. It is time to end the damn wars and unite with each other. We need to unite like we have never united before and let them know that we pay their salaries. They need to do their damn job and they need to end the damn wars.